Today is March 14th, and for the math lovers out there, it is Pi Day. Let's take a look appropriately by the numbers. Pi, the ratio of a circle's circumference to its diameter, equals 3.14159 for short, which is why we mark 314 as Pi Day, regardless of the size of a circle. The circumference and diameter always have that same exact ratio. The mathematical constant has been calculated to more than one trillion digits behind its decimal point and amazingly continues infinitely without repetition or pattern. Pi dates back to approximately 250 BC when the Greek mathematician Archimedes was considered the first person to accurately approximate pi. So how did Pi Day come about? Well, back in 1988, a physicist at the San Francisco Exploratorium Science Museum organized the earliest known celebration with the staff marching in a circle and then eating pie. It's now become a pop cultural phenomenon of sorts with discounts on pie and pizza available in many places today. And in 2009, the U.S. House passed a non-binding resolution recognizing March 14th as a National Pi Day, which also happens to be physicist Albert Einstein's birthday. One historical footnote, back in 1897, the Indiana State Legislature actually considered a bill to change pi to 3.2 to simplify things based on a local doctor's formula. Spoiler alert, it did not work, thanks to a Purdue math professor who intervened. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.